Hello and welcome to a tour of Notion Habit Tracker. In this video, I will show you how to use the template, its features, and how to customize the habits. Before getting started, this template is free and can be downloaded by clicking on the link in the description below. But in the meantime, here's how to use it. To add a new entry, simply click the New button on the top right corner of the database. We can now check off each habit as we complete them and fill up the progress bar. Alternatively, we can use the Complete All button to check off all habits at once. Whatever habits we check off on the Habits database will automatically update on the calendar below. We can also set entries to repeat each day so that you no longer have to add them manually. Just make sure to select the Repeat Daily option and then click the Save button. To change the default habits, simply click on the property and rename the habit to whatever you like. You can also change the icon to match if you'd like. To remove unwanted habits, simply click the Delete Property button. However, this will require us to update the progress bar. Simply click Edit Property and change the Divide By number to the new number of habits you have. The progress bar will now work correctly. If you would like to add a new habit entirely, you can duplicate an existing habit and rename it once again, changing the icon if you'd like. However, this time we will need to update the progress bar formula. To do this, simply click Edit Property and then click the Edit Formula button. For each habit you add, you will need to include the following text shown on screen, making sure to rename the highlighted text to match up with your chosen habits. Once again, changing the divide by number to match up with the new number of habits you have. Because we have added a new property, we will need to update the calendar to show it. Simply click on the Properties button and have it show the new habit. This will now appear on the calendar. Lastly, we will need to update the Complete All button, click on Edit Another Property and select the new habit, then set the property to Checked and hit Save. The Complete All button will now check off all habits including the one we just added. You can repeat these steps with as many habits as you like. This template makes it super easy to track progress over time. Under each database is a percentage for how consistent we are with each habit and gets updated in real time. We can even view entries under different time frames using the Today, Weekly, Monthly, and Yearly tabs. To keep things clean and minimal, entries under the Yearly tab are grouped by month and can be toggled open or closed. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, you can download this template for free by clicking on the link in the description below. Thanks for watching.